okay so as you see on my sample run it was almost almost completely perfect but it was not able to complete the upload yearly report uh, function so let me check that here all right now we need to go to the process workflow and here upload yearly report well we i believe we have it we bind all the arguments needed in here oh it's report that wait i'm sorry This is, oh no, this is tax ID. This is the report path. This is the yearly report path. Year is the report year that this string. And this one is the upload ID. right now let me check this workflow I don't know what's wrong in here so let's say for example this one Let's put the default value. Then slash. That XLS. XLS X. Here, let's copy this one. On the year, let's use 2018. All right. Now let's refresh this page. And try this. Okay, problems were encountered. What, what was the problem? Okay, I'm not sure what's the problem is. Let me just try it again. Okay, try and try.
This is really a problem. What if I will manually do it? Let me just try. Select the file. Oh, I think there's really a problem with the web page. Okay. So I just uh, refresh the page. Now I will try to run this upload yearly report sequence again. I hope that it worked this time. Oh, it's really a problem with the web page. I think it's on the UI path or Acme's application. So let me just pause this video. Okay, so I think I don't know what's happening on the this application. Maybe I can try to reset the data. Maybe problem with the test data. So well, let's try it again. Alright, let's run this. There's still a problem. Let's just try it. How it work? Uh, before we before we move on in this sequence, make sure to remove the the value, the default value that we just put, and save this sequence. I think there's no problem on it. It was a website. It's just a website problem. So let me just check something here. Yep, I believe we were able to bind everything. So, yeah, let me try to test. 